Hey folks, welcome back to Complicated Things. Some things are not complicated, like this tether lock by Tether Tools. This is probably the oldest and one of the best pieces of equipment I have. It firmly holds my tether cable into the underside of my camera. And anybody that's watched me or been near me knows I need that because I always pull my cable out or stand on it or something. So it's brilliant. Now we recently met with the people at Tether Tools and they said, how is your tethering? What are you using? And I said, in honesty, in the studio, I have my big tether car. I love it, my big screen and everything. But where I am struggling a little bit is on mobile tethering, where I'm just usually using an Apple box or anything I can find to throw my EQ on. And they said, why don't you try this? And I said, sure. So let me show you what it looks like set up and then we will go through all the different pieces. Yeah, of course you are. You think I can say that? Ta-da! In the spirit of full transparency, I did not actually set this up all by myself. Actually, Jacob set all of it up. But I know what everything is, and I'm going to tell you. Um, the other thing I'm going to say in all honesty is we don't promote stuff on this channel that I don't like because I can't endorse something I don't like or don't use. And we actually took this out last week on a shoot that we did on location. It was a tight space and I have to say it really, really did well. Far better than me walking around looking for Apple boxes or you know my assistant holding the computer, which we've done. Um, so it really made a difference. So that's why I'm gonna talk about all the things that made a difference. So first of all, this is the Pro Tethering Kit. Comes with a lot of stuff. It comes with the table, a Lajo bracket, an Aero Pro Pad, a tether guard, an Aero cup holder, an Aero secure strap, an Aero XDC, an Aero clip-on hooks, strap more, and an Aero storage bag. So that's what the kit comes with. I'm not sure if we're using all of that or if we have some other extra pieces, but these are the things that I liked about it most. Number one, the wheels. I love these wheels. I love wheels. So being able to move this around on set was f fantastic, especially when you're in a short, uh, tight space and all of a sudden the lighting guy wants to put a light where your tether station is and you can actually make it easy to move around. So that was very cool. On set, we were using this uh, V-mount battery. And from that, we were powering this AC adapter. And from the AC adapter, we were powering A, my computer, B, my battery charger, C, my cell phone, and D, something else which I can't tell you about because I'm not allowed to show it for reasons unbeknown to me. Um, and that, that was all being powered as we were shooting. Now, depending on your DTAP battery, you could pretty much do this all day or switch out the battery. And I think that's pretty good. Um, not that I get to shoot all day very long, but if I did, that would be great. One of my most favorite things is this uh, cup holder, which I love, it's so simple. Um, and if you know me, then I tend to put my coffee cup right here and somebody, never me, never me, but somebody usually knocks it over. Um, and that has caused problems in the past with insurance and uh, computers and cameras. So having it here is a lot safer. I'm much happier with it. Um, a couple of clips that clip onto the side of the table, really useful. I'm using this one here to just clip my tether um, cable. Another, play, another thing I can never find space for anytime is my AC adapter for my computer. And it comes in that little pouch there, which is fantastic. And finally, we have a little shelf here underneath here, which is an excellent place to keep my cell phone, which is charging. So all in all, um, this is a lot better than me looking around for an Apple cart to put my stuff on. It has a lot of these nice features. Um, I'm not sure if we would use them all all the time, but we certainly use them. If there was one thing that I could ask for that this doesn't include, would potentially be a little more space. Um, I thought it was a little tight to have my camera 
on my computer here, but I do have a particularly um, big 17-inch uh, computer, and this is not a small camera. So it might not be a problem for some, but definitely was uh, I could have done with a little more space. Now, I did lean on this, and I'm not a small man. And when I leant on it, it moved. But I was told it moved because they had attached it with the ball head, and you don't lean on a ball head, apparently. So when we attached it just using the baby pin, nothing moved at all, and uh, it was really very stable. So um, thank you to Tether Tools for sending this over. Definitely going to be part of the kit. Um, definitely something that makes my life as a photographer easier on location. See you next time. Bye.